Hi girls, thank you for shopping at Drop Dead Gorgeous again. My name is Grace. Um, I'm here again with another tutorial for your autumn winter look. And um, this tutorial that I'm doing is from Vero, is, well, Vera Wang Inspires. Um, it's a grungy type look, uh, well, eye makeup. And um, I've just gone ahead and done one eye. I haven't finished the whole look completely, so let's get into it. And um, what you need is, um, what you're going to do first is just line, uh, lightly line your eye, top and bottom. It doesn't matter if it gets messy like that because it's just going to add to the effect. Then you want to take like a deep metallic purple um, and apply it to the center here. Just layer it on. This is quite a layered look and you're going to blend it all out. And then take like a charcoal grey. So charcoal blacky grey colour. It doesn't matter if you haven't got the exact colours, but they're the kind of tones that you're going to look you're going to be leaning towards to create this look. Um so apply that up above where you apply the purple. Take a blending brush. You want it to kind of fade into the other one, so the purple needs to fade into the charcoal grey, okay? Take my big fluffy brush then to blend it in completely then. Then for underneath the bottom lid, take a rich brown. That will just bring out the purple colour that you apply to the centre there. So just underneath, sweep like a rich brown colour underneath. And again, along the edge, soften up the hard edges. You leave, you don't put mascara on at all, you leave your eyes pretty bare, you don't fill in your eyebrows. The foundation needs to be barely there, kind of like cover up any blemishes you have, maybe with concealer, but keep the foundation really, really light. You take a highlighter and down the centre of your nose, this will kind of blend it in. And in the inner corner of your eyes as well. Turn this off there. Down the centre of your nose. Okay. This will give that silly finish that you need and you want. You want to contour the face then with a bronzer. So sweep bronzer across your forehead there. Underneath your cheekbones. 
along your jawline as well. That will just give more definition to your jaw. Pure bones. Give a stronger face shape. And the thing with this look then is, for kind of like a pretty contrast, they use um, like a frosted shimmer pink on the lips. Just a pretty kind of contrast with the goddess kind of eyes. You just dab that on. So frosted pink. If you don't have one, again, as I said, girls, mix your colors. I mean, you can pick up lipstick so cheap anyways, but if you haven't got one, you can just mix it up and maybe put a little bit of an illuminator in the lipstick that you have got and that might give you a little bit of a, a frosted look. And the hair to go with this one, for this particular trend is, that my hair is still wet, I'm only out of the shower, but um, it's just gel back off the face. And um, So I haven't got gel in mine, but if you apply gel off to pull it back off your face and then just let your hair fall loosely. So there you go, that's your kind of gothic look from Vera Wang. Um, I think it's pretty cool. Um, yeah, if you don't, if you're not keen on the too heavy of the eye, I mean, you can always keep it to a minimum, change the colours up a little bit if you're not a fan of purples, but um, it's pretty intense, I think it looks really, really cool. I hope you enjoyed the tutorial and it was easy enough to follow, and um, I'll talk to you all soon. Thanks for shopping with Drop Dead Gorgeous again. Bye!